Good morning, peoples. Good morning, good morning, good morning. I'm just an hour earlier than my normal time, but I promised a very short live today. So I'm hoping uh, some of you will join in with me. I have been a very, very busy bee today, or actually this last past week, so i um, been in the process of making a few things for Halloween. So I thought I would share uh, a few of these with you. For whoever wants to come join. Anyway, is anybody out there? Anybody with me? Just a touch early. Where is everybody? Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and get this started. Um, what you're going to need for these are some just random bottles that you would normally empty out. Everybody knows what this color is. <clears throat> and make sure you get the labels off whatever you're working with or if you've got just a regular bottle. That's wonderful. Um, so, what we're going to do is um, we are going to make something very very similar to this this is one of the bottles that I made yesterday well, hello hello peoples and I also have this one Also have this one here. Y'all can see that the camera is kind of wanting to do the slippy slide today, so I just said let it go. But we're going to be making something very, very similar to the green one that you just seen. Then I also have another one here that I'm very proud of, actually. Took me a minute to do. Has a little stopper that I made for the top. Almost looks like a witch's hat. Just straight black. Be too good if it fell. <clears throat> and then we also have this one. So, what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and get these started. Now, it's very, very simple. Just take your bottle. Make sure you have enough glue, gun, glue in your gun and you also have extras because this part is going to take a lot of glue. Just take the, uh, on the edge here, at the very opening, and just kind of glob it there and then run it down the side of your bottle. Doesn't matter how you put it on there because the messier the better. Because as you know, nothing is perfect. 
Make it look like wax been dripping. I've got a refill already. Continue going down. it takes a minute for the glue to heat up and I use quite a bit of it at the time so is there anybody in here with me watching and just being quiet Very quiet in here today, but that's okay. Well, good morning, Gail. Dang, Emily, I always forget you are an hour ahead of me. <laughs> That's okay. I'm actually on an hour early. making altered Halloween potion bottles. I'm 
You missed the very beginning where I uh, showed you off. I have no idea. I know I'm in Georgia. That's all I know. She, I hadn't seen her. She said she was in here, but she's getting a prescription filled, so, and I hadn't seen her. Got to have a lot of glue, gun, glue for this one. This is a request from Mr. James Lee. He liked the one he liked the ones I was working on last night, and so he asked me to make some more. So we are making some more. <laughs> wow, I need a new glue gun. Look at that. That's horrid. That's coming from the tip. That is so raunchy. I've got to get me a new one. I think they sell them at the Dollar General. I don't know. I don't know how good they are, though. Went through five glue sticks with this so far. I gotta go get some more. Go get your medicine. That's okay. Do what you got to do. Do what you got to do. These are going to go on my porch. Can't wait for them to get done. All right. Going to have a lot of glue strings. But so far, here is the unpainted drippage. Looks like one of them old Count Dracula bottles that you see in their movies where the wax is done drip from the top. Gonna let set that to the side, and we are going to do another one. But first, I gotta go get some more glue sticks because that took every bit of the ones I had sitting here. Screw it. Let's get my whole bag. Well, hi, Jada. All right. Let's... You missed us the first bottle. What we're doing is we're altering uh, bottles for Halloween, making potion bottles. And while this is drying, I'll show you the ones that uh, everybody missed. But uh, the one that I'm making right now is going to look very similar to this one.
and he likes that one and I've got to make one like this but he wants it uh, goblin something I can't think remember I can't remember what he said <laughs> how funny and that's one of the ones we're gonna be making To show you guys this one I'm very proud of because this one took me a minute to do because uh, it says witch's brew but I kind of sort of made a little uh, cap or bottle plug plunger made from hot glue and it looks like a witch's hat you put it on looks like a witch I need to fix my camera view, camera view, but y'all can't see my dirty, dirty, dirty craft room. <laughs> I've been crafting like a razor. And then my poison, my poison bottle. Nothing special, just that triple X in the poison. You all only seen pictures of my spell book, but I want to show you what my spell book looks like. I thought that turned out rather nicely. What do you guys think? Yes, it did. It turned out really nice. And even on the side, even on the spine. I'm here going to and going into will be right back. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, and this is just a normal book. I, it was a bonus that it even had this. Is that hot glue too? Yes, the cover is actually. That is hot glue, but this right here and this right here is not. However, this does look like hot glue. But I had some do. I had to do some finagling to get that in there like that, make it look like it was pressed into the book. It was really neat. I really liked working on this one. But yeah, that is my spell book, and even the back looks nice. And all that is is hot glue, tissue paper, black paint, and metallic paint. That's all that is, besides the little trinkets that you can get in like little kids' pack, play packs. And so yeah, that is what it is. And I did not put this directly on the cover of this book. I made my own. I put a piece of paper covering the book and hot glued it down so it I can take this off whenever Halloween's over with, um, because it'll come it'll come right off. But I can keep the cover for maybe an, a journal or something. But this is really neat. But I figure I'd show you guys that, and I'm not bringing my signs over here because I foobarred one of them up, and Spanky's the one that caught it. She's like, um. Something's not right here. <laughs> so, when you try to take it off, what? Ooh, I'd be afraid it would crack. No, all this stuff is hot glue. And I put tissue paper over top of the hot glue to seal in the, um, the hot glue on the book. And uh, I painted over it. And that's what gave it that raised up and ghoulish look to it. Now. I am going to go ahead and start on this next one. It's going to look very similar to this one, the topo. It's going to look very similar to that one. So are we going to get this started? Oh, that's coming out a lot easier because I was trying to push it out when it was not hot. y'all 
can't see. Sorry, my camera angle's kind of off today. Usually I have it up a little higher, don't I? very simple. I don't know if y'all can see that. That's very simple. I'm going to see if I can mess with this camera angle because I'm not liking it. Let's see. There we go. I think that's slightly better. There we go. Yeah, I can see it just a little better now. I don't have to. What do y'all guys think? I mean, that's just the beginning. This is the ugly duckling stage. I've got to get in my closet and find my other bottles that I'm just going to take out because James Lee found some that will that would be perfect for this but just to sit out because it has those little um, glass stoppers and I don't have to worry about altering them because they've already got this really cool design on them. Show y'all. Well, that's two down. One to go. I gotta wait till that dries. Because that one is going to be, the, the tall one's going to be red, and this one's going to be green with Goblin's Breath written on it. And I don't know about this one. Hmm. So what do you guys think should be on this one? Just write, to write something. What do you guys think? I'm going to let y'all participate in this one. Because it is Friday, and what is it? Audience Participation Friday. So I'm going to let you guys tell me what y'all want on this one. It's your decision. Just make it small so that way people can see it. It has to have about this, be about this wide because people can only see for so, uh, so far because they're going to be at trick or treating with their kids. Could you do a bat? That's too much glue. <laughs> and I'd have to sit down and you can't, I have to sit down and actually literally draw the bat because hot glue would not work well. That's a lot of glue. What do you guys think? It has to do with something for like uh, like witches and brews and all that. Can you spell out boo? <laughs> yeah, I can spell out boo, but wouldn't it wouldn't go along with the theme because it's typo, blood type negative, zero or O negative, poison, devil's breath, witch's brew, and then the the melted wax candles. So. That's to kind of go with the, the decor on that. So what do you guys think? The 
the sock. Booze. Oh, come on, Gail. You can't write that. Has to be kid friendly. Come on. Huh. Well, that would be funny. <laughs> it would be a joke for the adults. But I don't think they'd like it too well because it would be a, an adult joke. Now I can put it on a piece of paper, draw it out, and do it like I did the witch's brew. Because I've got a good section of it right here yeah, I can do. But let me see what I miss time what I miss now, time to pick up medicine. <laughs> Wow. Let me see what I can do with this. guess thing. Well, hi, Tracy. What do you guys think? Cut that out and glue it on like my witch's breath or my whatever that is. Witch's brew. Yeah. Let's see. Probably have to go back over it with the pen, but. How are you doing today, Tracy? Newt. Yeah, that is true. Might have to go grab another small bottle and do one. <laughs> uh, uh, what? I know one crab. My grandbaby. Oh, I'm so sorry, Tracy. My condolences go to you and your family. got to sharpen my scissors. I've got paint on them. Take my pen and kind of reinforce that edge there.
my head is down so if you're saying something I will read that message here in just a second my apologies Cut out. Oh, she gave you big hugs. get this on there strings go away go away strings and don't stick to me while you're at it please and it's on there and the good part about this is is I can peel all of this off if I want to and start over and it's on Okay, now to do the top. Hi, oh, precious so and so. Hi, Teresa. You've missed some of our bottles. Hmm. Go get one more. A pretty little brown one, but it's gonna get painted. Okay. Yes, she is. Ooh. All right. Now, y'all done got me wanting to uh, do that eye of newt. <sighs> okay, let's see. I can see the wax spotter that looks cool. It's actually hot glue, guys. Whoa. Well, I thought that said. Yeah, I'm showing you guys the easiest way. If y'all drink the alcohol beverage, sort of like from these bottles, you can make anything from them. I'm so mad at Cooper right now I could spit bullets that uh, those little beads that I bought those little fingernail things 
you can put on your nails or use it as a as an accent for a piece. Well, apparently he got into the bag this morning and decided he wanted to chew the box up and spread my little teeny tiny, little tiny lead top beads or things, jewels, all over his dog pen. And so I spent the last 20 minutes before the show cleaning them little things up. I was so mad because the box was so small. I didn't notice it was in there and he about got my new stencil. I was so mad. That's the reason why I've been keeping him locked up here lately because he can't, he cannot stay out of stuff. There, I added the iris to it. What you guys think? Ain't that creepy? Haha, <laughs> I like it. <sighs> now to put that on there. Gotta put another glue stick in. <gasps> yep, better. That's funny because I just got a bottle to decorate. Ooh. Well, maybe you can decorate with me and share your pictures in the group. Yeah, yes. Yeah. on upside down. I'd have been mad. That'd have been very, very angry. What's funny is whenever this painted, these little, uh, these things right here are actually, you can't really see them, but it actually looked pretty cool with this. Now to put the drippage on here after this you'll see the fun begin because I gotta paint the bottle and you'll see get you'll see me get all black I will turn blacker and nice of spades with that paint because it's, it's, uh, it's the color jet black not just like the opaque black no it's jet black I have been wiping paint off of me for the last three days so I've been using so much black and white oh my god you should see my desk yesterday and my floor it still has paint on, on my floor it was bad I worked all day in here from like 9 o'clock all the way till about 10 o'clock last night. But he liked the turnout. He was mad because I was in here all day, but he got home really early yesterday, so I was happy. But uh, he was mad that I was in here all day. I said, hey, this is what I do when you're at work. This is what I do. I do my chores first, and then I get what I need done done. <clears throat> so... Just imagine when that's painted, that's going to look some pretty bad stuff. i got to call Dr. Sofa's going to tune Diane. Okay. <coughs> Alright, I'm going to let that dry. And I'm going to paint everything black first. So, burr with me. about the, the strings it makes it look even creepier seeing it transform from 
this to this. I love those blue bottles. Well, if you drink um, an alcohol beverage uh, that has the blue bottles, you'll be able to get that. I'm not promoting them, but this is the uh, Bud Light Platinum bottles. I don't own any rights to them. I am not promoting them. I'm just stating what these bottles are from. There we go. Now we got that good and cleared up. I have a whole box full of these blue bottles. So, yeah, I'm going to unplug my, wait a minute. Yeah, I'm going to unplug my glue gun because I've done with the glue gun. Unless I find, I want to do something else. There we go. Well, 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 I'm shit out of luck. Don't drink it all. Huh? Well, go to your liquor store. They'll, they'll have to, uh, go and see if they're throwing out any bottles or, or uh, like bars or something. I'm pretty sure they throw out bottles all the time. You can ha uh, you can ask them if they if you can have them. I've been told you could do that. I am about out of black paint, ladies, and this is gonna suck. I gotta be very careful on the amount of paint that I use. Make sure I get it covered the first time instead of having to go back a hundred times with it. Alright, that turned that transformed from a blue bottle to a black bottle. And once I get that done, those little glue drips are going to be red. They're going to be awesome. Set that right there. Get it off my finger. Alright. Now for this one. stuff is so simple. I haven't been able to do this for years because I've been not able to decorate or anything. This is the first house I've had since 2012 and I'm just excited. And before that it was 2009. I, got, I decorated my grandfather's house and if you look back in the pictures in the Creative Jewels by Emily uh, photos you will see a picture of a house that uh, I decorated. It was an apartment that I shared with someone and uh, I decorated both sides and you'll be able to see a picture of that but I don't know how far in the photos it is so it kind of got snuck in there by accident. Ooh, that one's too hot. Good thing this is a smaller bottle to take that much paint. Sorry for not talking. <laughs> when I get into the painting zone, I'm in it. I, I hardly ever look up. So if it looks like I'm not paying attention to you, it's not intentional. And I do apologize. See that bottle went from blue to black plus you can see that really well. And now for the brown one. Y'all see how brown that is, right? Ugly looking brown. And that glue is still wet too. Oh, it might be from where it's sitting under my lamp. Might.
from brown to black. Quick and simple and still have a little bit of a brown tint to it. When the light hits it. There you go. Once these, uh, once the black paint dries, I can start in on the uh, the other colors. <laughs> yeah, get that off of there and just kind of put that in there. Don't waste a lick of black paint, man. All right, while that is drying, I can sit here for a minute. If you'll excuse me, I'm going to go grab me something really quick to drink because I'm thirsty and I didn't grab anything before I came in here, so give me just a second. about that ladies all right do we have anybody new join yet y'all yeah can't drink anymore i never did drink much for meds i don't take oh okay Whew. i had to go get some tea he has misplaced my power so i had to put my tea in, in a gatorade bottle mm. so it went off we have dry paint yet? That'll do. That'll do. Now I'm taking some uh, real red gloss paint. That's what makes the the shine on this. So what's everybody working on? Anybody working with me? Crafting along? Barking. He's playing and he's barking. 
Y'all can probably hear him. Cooper! Chill out, boy. Now that first layer does not have to be perfect. Just make sure you just you kind of get it onto the the hot glue because we're gonna go over that a few times. I mean, it's it's gonna be dark anyway, so the creepier the better, right? my phone whenever I'm not online I just set my phone up on the charger and set it sideways and I can watch and play at the same time what time is it here I don't even know it's almost 12 at the bottom of this one is not dry but that's okay it's mixing with the red that's okay that is okay Y'all will start to see what it's looking like after I get done with one side. It goes on and on and on and on and on. Has anybody made anything for Halloween? I know a few of you have. I've seen Pictus. Ah, crud. It wasn't on the painted side. <laughs> Hi, Mama. I've been on an hour. I was on an hour early today. So I've got some things I've got to do. The plumber called. Right before I about the uh, right before I went online, and he's wanting to stop by, and I kind of got some things that I've got to do, so I don't think today would be a very good day for him to come by. Not a very good day at all. Yeah. actually gonna look I mean it, it's gonna look really cool when I, once I get done it's just in the very beginning stages of coolness <laughs> what do you see the one I'm gonna do with the goblin <laughs> Okay. 
Hello for all the hello to all the people who are viewing. Hello, hello, hello for the people who popped in while my head was down. <laughs> Now that's just the first coat. First coat done. What do you guys think? Now we need to move on and then do it this away because I'm not going to use very much of this oh it shot on me <laughs> I'm gonna put it in the tip of my finger and just rub And voila, there you go. I've newt. Very simple, quick, not too many ingredients. <laughs> that you need or supplies. I have newt is complete and this one was for who was it Gail I have newt there you go there's your I have newt yes that is a beer bottle this is a beer bottle let me show you what it used to look like used to look like this. Just a regular plain Jane beer bottle that turned into this. So you can do anything with recycled products. <clears throat> Alright, he wanted... Goblin something. Oh my goodness. Goblin. Goblin blood, I think. He wanted the, the dark green. This one's not going to be as hard. I've got two, three different colored greens, but I chose the brightest ones because they they pop on black. They pop out, and they are bright as can be. I'm 
I'm not putting other color paints on this. So who's wanting to go get you get them a beer, empty the bottle out, and and make one of these, huh? So Thampa or heck, go to your buddy's house that drinks beer. See if they got one laying around in the front yard, or you know, take a walk on the side of the road, pick one up. They're everywhere. make sure you clean them first. Yes, clean them. Don't use them straight up. Clean and sanitize them twice if you have to. This process uh, for getting the labels off of these bottles, it took two days to get the labels off. Because what I did was is I took some um, OxyClean and I run very, very, very piping hot water. Hey, you could use liquor bottles. Hey, use lick them. Uh, lick them. La, 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 la. Uh, use liquor bottles. You can do that. That's actually makes some of the better potion bottles. But this is just something that I had on hand. But anyway, um... It took two days to, to get the labels off these bottles. I took some OxyClean powder and I soaked them in some really, really hot water. And I'd check on them every few hours to see if the labels were slick to the touch. And you, sometimes you can easily swab them off. Now, sometimes you will have a, um, a sticky residue. And I just took a little bit of steel wool and I rubbed it across the bottle and it got all the sticky off. So... Yes. I am so proud of my honey. He brought me home a lot of my the rest of my costume last night or yesterday. He brought me my jewelry that I'm going to be wearing. The only thing that I'm lacking is my earrings, which I'm going to poss possibly make them. Um, he got my necklace. He got my headband. Everything. And all I got to do is fix my hair. And I went to the Goodwill yesterday while I was out and about exploring, and I found a black um, wrap that I'm going to wrap around my waist for the gypsy, uh, for the gypsy wrap, and it looks just like the one that I'm going to decorate it up with some beads, and it's already got some kind of shimmery stuff on it, like little sequins, and I'm going to decorate it up with some of my beads that I was making. So I. It's going to look authentic. <laughs> he even found some bangle bracelets, too. And I'm going to dress them up and make them look nice. I will definitely post pictures. Might even do a live with my makeup and stuff. I don't know. This depends. Depends on how busy my day is because this weekend we're going to be putting all these ghoulish... Um, I'm sh you are y'all crazy? You know y'all. You know I'm gonna take pictures. <laughs> I'm gonna take pictures of the yard when it's decorated too. We're gonna go out this weekend and get some laundry done because our laundry mat's just right down the road and around the corner, so it's not that far of a, a hike. I was hor I was a horrible Lady Gaga last year at work for Halloween. Oh, <laughs> well, last year I didn't really get to dress up, but I did my makeup and. I had my hair up in pigtails and some bright pink makeup and glitter and I'd ask the uh, a lot uh, the children that I, when I ran a rat I was like what do you think I am and they'd guess I said yep you're right so I'd let them I'd let them think whatever they thought I was because I had them up in real pretty little pigtails and just look like a little princess sometimes I had people tell me I look like um uh, like a fairy or a princess or a, 
um, or something. But yeah. See how well that's turning out just from coats of paint? I gotta get that red one before my paint dries it in there, but that's a glossy. Glossy doesn't dry as fast. This is a matte, and mattes dry rather quickly, especially apple barrel paint. It dries rather quickly. So I can get the coats on. By the time I get around to the beginning, that coat's already dried, so I can add another coat. And then at the end, I'm going to write Goblin's Blood on it for James Lee. His, this is mainly why I did this. I haven't dressed up for Halloween for the last four years. No one comes to my house for treats, so why bother? That's true. I asked the landlord the other day if uh, we got trick-or-treaters, but we're in actually a very nice neighborhood where a lot of traffic kind of comes through here during the day. And, and so I'm going to put out my sign, the trick-or-treat here sign at the road. So I'm going to put that up during the uh, Sunday. That way the parents can see that. That we are going to be participating in the trick-or-treating. That way they can bring their children over here and enjoy the scenery and have some goodies. Alright. That painting session is done. Now I just got to write the goblin's blood on it and then I will be done with this one. the whole reason why I did this live and you all missed me so I figure I'd do this and play for a little bit and talk with you guys because everybody was seeing all kinds of pictures and not seeing my face I've just been really, really busy. Y'all were tuning in on some of my work that I needed to do today, so. All right, there it goes. Goblin's blood. can't see that. It's okay. Make it look like the witch is and using it. There you go. There you go. Two down, two to go. Oh. I can't remember where I was going. Oh, I already got that. Bat wings. Let's do that in gold. That's 
folk art gold metallic paint. You don't need much of this either. Huh. I'm just waiting for the red to dry because that was a lot of paint. off with me. Buttons. There we go. And used every bit of that gold paint. Now for the red again. Y'all got really, really quiet on me. What happened? Am I boring you guys? Hoping not. Still here, I'm just multitasking while watching. Oh, yes, Gail, I think it was last year. I feel. Whoa, I missed some conversation. Just a little bit of conversation while I was painting, apparently. Oh, you're multitasking too. Where'd KK go? Or uh, KK go? Is she still at the doctor? Are you being quiet, KK? to go get my pumpkins sometime this weekend and carve those. Those are going to be interesting. Can't wait to do that, but I don't want the mess. That's going to kill my hands. Because we got to tote everything home by hand. 
that's going to suck because I don't know anything about the cab services out here and how much they charge or if they do cash or you have to have a card. I don't know. I don't know much about nothing out here. But we are across the street from an Ingalls and Goodwill is right next door so that's a good thing. So I'll be visiting them on a frequently basis. They didn't have very much craft stuff. But I did find me a um, filing folder that has the hanging folders in it. And uh, I've been looking for one of those. And I got a uh, filing thing. You know how they stack on top of each other? It's the black little trays. I got, I got one of those that has two trays on it. So I'm going to kind of make things a little bit more organized with what I have. Especially my papers and stuff in the hanging file thing that way I can easily get to it and I know where it's at and not have to go looking for it so that's a good thing I only paid like five bucks for all of it I just brought a little bit of money that I had kind of stuck back when he got paid I kind of stuck it to the side and went on a Google or a Goodwill or a thrift store or something yesterday morning and I went. Oh my goodness. You're very popular today, Gail. Well, that black paint right there wasn't dry. Not dry at all. Like this is turning out rather nicely. Got two more coats and it should be good. <laughs> I'm so sorry guys, it's really quiet today. Very, very quiet. A lot to think about. Is anybody else decorating outside for Halloween? Anybody got any outside stuff already up or? What y'all doing for the outside? Y'all putting the pumpkin out? Y'all just saying screw it and not doing anything at all? What are y'all doing? Not you. but I'm trying to get the coats on real thick that way I don't have to do it so many times
Oh crap, I gotta go get that deer outside and paint blood on its face. Ugh, I don't want to. I'll do that off camera. I gotta paint a bloody face. But yeah, so far, so good. I think that's all I'll do for that one. Let that dry. But yes, we have completed four bottles from start to finish. Got that one. wings got the goblin's blood and then we have the eye loot So, I hope you guys liked it. Wow, I, I told him I'd be done by 1230, and it is 1230. Wow, I'm good. <laughs> I timed that just right. So, did you guys like, or am I going to get thumbs down today? This was just a very quick one. Not a lot of detail. No, it's not 30. Oh well. It's not 30 where you are. It's 12:30 where I am. For watching four thumbs up. I see only three thumbs up, but that's okay. I hope he likes all these bottles because we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. You know what? Let's make that an even ten. And we will uh we will make something, one more, just to make it a little more even. Let's see, what can I put on this one? Hmm. cold. It is cold in here. Must have not plugged that in my heater while I was in here. Let's see. Okay, we've got bats wings, devil's breath, poison. Ah. Uh, I know. Scorpion blood. I was going with nightshade. I was going to go with the nightshade. Looking for the silvery blue. Let's see. Gotta make sure they rot because I've been having trouble getting them to rot. That would have been perfect too because it's a real metallic blue, but it not wanting to write. There we are.
on that because you can't see it, daggummit. the glittery on it show up really nice. <clears throat> you know what I unclogged my blue gun? Go figure. surfing from her my tacky glue because that takes for freaking ever to dry. So I'll plug this up and it only takes a few minutes. Oh we have been eating very lightly here lately because I haven't got my kitchen all the way set up yet so my cooking show is still being put on hold until I can get it completely set up because our lighting in there is just one bulb in the center of the room and it's very dull and so we've got to work on some kind of lighting to to uh to uh light it up a little bit i haven't played with all of these colors yet they're so pretty used to have a big set of these when I was a kid. My mom bought them for me for my birthday. And, uh, I, um, don't remember what I did with them. I played with them all the time. Oh. Everybody get quiet. They must be working on something. I forgot to put the right saying, so I have to had to go back because it was deadly not shade is what everybody associates witches with. I can't wait to do my makeup because I've got to do James Lee's makeup and. That's going to take longer than mine. His is probably going to look better than mine, but mine's going to be a better costume because I went and got him a uh, black button-up shirt for his Reaper costume because I could not find a black cape to go with his costume. Because he's going to just wear a pair of black pants and a black 
collared uh, uncollared shirt, but it almost looks like a uh, uh, a way pasture shirt. You know how they have the the no collar on theirs to hire up idiots. Up, buddy, heat up. Get her done. Get her done. Uh, you preferred I make them rather than buy those Tinsy plastic store ones. Yeah, my mom always made ours too. Oh, my mom never knew that I was scared of clowns and always dressed me up as a dang clown when I was a kid. I hated them. And sad thing is, I worked at McDonald's and um, Ronald McDonald decided it wanted to make an appearance. And so I warned him. I was like, listen, you've got two, two choices. It's like whenever he comes around, you can either take me off the floor and let me go hide. Or I will smack the crap out of it. I don't care who you are. I don't care if you're my best friend. Take the clown suit off. Like, take the clown makeup off and I'll be your best friend. You put that clown med, uh, medicine, er, uh, makeup on, I will hate you for every, for every minute you got that makeup and, and costume on. I took my own kids to the circus and I ran from the daggum clowns. I let my kids get around them because I was scared, too scared around them when, I was, when they were younger. Y'all are learning a little bit about me, huh? I hate clowns. Come on, glue gun, heat up, buddy. You weren't this hard to heat up before. I could have already had you already on this dang bottle. Oh, hi, Kiki. Or, okay. Yeah, Kiki. Posting my group, I hope. More show up well i'm about done i'm just actually this one's a spur of the moment because i had extra paper and a bottle already sitting out but uh, if they pop if they start popping in they'll have to go back and look at the very beginning wow well, a lot of my uh a lot of my um Moderators are in here. That's awesome. <sighs> Ladies, it's freaking cold in here. What in the world? I forgot to turn it on. I had it plugged up. I forgot to turn it on. What? What? <laughs> oh my goodness. If they start showing up, I'll go and grab a few more bottles out of my bag, but I don't have any more after that because all the, uh, the ones that I do have have still got the labels on it, and that would that's going to take a little bit. Mine shows two watching yet. I see four, four or five in chat. That's okay. That, YouTube lies sometimes. That is okay.
Ain't no biggie. Ain't no biggie biggie. All right, are we are, are we dripping yet? Are we are we are we dripping? Yes, we are. <gasps> we can get that on there. Ugh! <coughs> the air freshener that I have in my room smells like dog shampoo. I just breathed in a big old waft of it. Ugh. A string of hot glue and I'm trying to get this on here if it messes it up I'm gonna be mad You have about three seconds after you lay that paper down on this bottle for it to to harden up. I wish I had my exacto knife and exactly where I put it, but I had moved it and I don't know exactly where it's at. Oh, there it is. Wait a minute. I might be able to do this. Hmm. I am trying to find those corks that Robbie sent me. Here they go. Nope. Lid Robin or Pauline. I'm not sure. I want to make a cork top for that. But I don't remember who sent it to me and where I put them. I guess I'll have to do that later type of project. Well, hello, peoples. Yes, welcome to all that have joined us. You know, I have to admit I have more than one screen open and, and I'm switching back and forth. I wonder if it makes a difference to the number of people. I 
what? If YouTube notice doesn't go out, this is why I post the first in my group. Oh, okay. Cool. Well, I was going to make me a cork, uh, cork top uh, thing for the top here, but apparently I have misplaced the corks that I was going to use. And I cannot find them. I thought maybe that would look really neat with it. But I guess it didn't work out so well. Ugh. get to the top. There we go. I paint one of these keys black. Since it's got a gold accent to it, I won't even need to really do anything with it. So this is how I get covered in black paint, guys. I don't always do things with my hands. I never pick anything up with, with gloves or anything. Why well, do that when you can pick things up with your hands? Is there any newbies in here? Because I'd really love to show you what we have done. Um, we have made several things today. And these are just impromptu things that uh Yes, artists have a dirty hands at the end of the day. Be right back, gotta heat up my coffee. Okay, Gail. We'll be here. Kiki and us Kiki and stain fingernails at least in my case. Well I've got cleaners that I clean my hands with. I hate dirty fingernails, and so if y'all ever see me do a video and I have dirty fingernails, then I haven't had a chance to clean them, but I cannot stand dirty fingernails. I clean them with cleaners, and I scrub them, and yeah, I try and keep them clean. I just put paint on my face. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. So let that dry, and we will find a piece of ribbon put on that, because I'm going to do one more. Because I have one last bottle, and it's a brown one. It's the last clean bottle that I have. And these are for, and this is for the people that have just joined us and missed most of what we were doing earlier, so they can catch something really cool. <clears throat> and it's always have glue dried on my fingers. Oh, I love to peel it off. Oh, me too. You ever, you, you ever play with glue when you were a kid? You know, you put a pile of it right here, and you did this right here, and you smushed it all over your hands. And you did right, did like this, and waited for it to dry. That way, you could peel it right off. Uh, you know, I still enjoy doing that every now and again. But that's a waste of glue because I'm a glue girl, and I don't want to waste my glue. I need me a swatch of the ribbon.
to work. Yeah, it should. Alright. Oh, I'm gluing my cord. <laughs> well, that's more protection. Okay. That'll work on that one. And this key is drying. So we will paint this bottle a metallic. Since it's got brown up underneath it, we can paint it a metallic color and it won't know no different. It actually make the bottle look even prettier. And do I have a clean brush? Is that dry? Yeah. Oh shucks. I didn't need to put that much in there. It's kind of whizzing out. I should make the bottle look kind of cool since it's brown up underneath. If you're a kid, you really won't know what, that this is a real beer bottle. <laughs> and it's got raised, uh, raised things on it, so it'll go real good with the, the bottle. better do you with this metallic paint. Amazing what you can do with bottles and paint. A little bit of glue and paper. I still gotta make me my ghosties outside. Gotta do that. With paper mache and balloons. So I've got a uh yeah, tomato wire, you know the little tomato cones. Gotta make me a little head out of it, out of paper mache. Just bowl it up with a balloon and put paper mache on it, and make me a head from that. And put my pieces of material that James Lee found me the other day over top of it because it's they're white. It's like a glitter to it. I make curtains out of it after that, and uh, make a covering for the head. Like I said, I've got so many things that I still want to do. Just I'm running out of time. This move kind of hurt me whenever it came down to my Halloween decorations, but you know I've got more of a yard to play with here. Well, not technically. I had a bigger front yard in the other trailer, but, you know, I've got a huge backyard, so that compensates for it. Well, hi, Michelle. I just seen you pop in. I just looked up, and there you were. This deadly nightshade. And that was a brown bottle. Like this. Covered it and got, well, hi, Jamie. And that was just a brown bottle. Well, I have got to show you, Miss Jamie. 
I gotta show you what I've been working on today. I'm proud of these. <clears throat> okay, this is my, our this is the impromptu that I just did. Uh, this is the deadly night shade. Hang on a minute. That might be the honey. I just heard. Sure hope that paint won't wash off those bottles are outside. Oh no, these are gonna be under a covered porch. This is gonna be on my porch. And plus, I have y'all forget I'm a crafter. Y'all forget where's it at? I have sealer. I have sealer. I will. Uh, I will seal them. I have bukus and bouts of that, so that's a, uh, uh oh, my battery's low. Why is it not charging? Hang on, guys. Oh, no. My charging port fell out. Wonderful. I bet you it's not going to charge now. Oh, Halloween is Tuesday, but uh-uh. Halloween is Monday, I think. Is it Monday or Tuesday? I don't know. I have to look at my calendar. I don't know. It's Tuesday. Oh, wow. I didn't realize that. I thought it was Monday. Whew. Okay. Anyway, this is our Deadly Night Shade. Okay. And this is our Blood Candle. And this is our bat swing I have lost days you guys so you're going to have to give me credit here <laughs> okay and this is our eye of newt we have been crafting I'm a lot of talking I've been real quiet today and then our goblin blood. Yes, I have. We've been busy. You should see the other ones that I did yesterday. And those are the ones that we did today. We're about to do another one. We're about to do another one. But I don't know how long my battery's going to last, guys. So I'm at 10%. Apparently, my cord got unplugged the last time I got up. So, <clears throat> But uh, I'm going to quickly show you this. That way I can get the other one done. And then there, here's the poison one I did yesterday. And here is the green one with the equivalent of the red one. This was James Lee's bottle. He wanted to help me with one. It was called Devil's Breath. And this one is Blood Type O Negative. And then this one's my favorite. This one's called Witch's Brew. And I made a little hat as a stopper to go on top of this one. I can get it back in there. Here we go. So, yeah, 
I was a busy girl yesterday, and you should see the signs that I made. You, I don't know if you've seen the pictures or not. But yeah, all of these are going on my front porch. Lining my porch along with my pumpkins, which I haven't got yet. Sorry, ladies, I've been busy since I got home. That's okay, Kiki. Or KK, sorry. Kiki's in here. fix this because it kind of came undone on me so got a glue down there we go I knew <laughs> hello everybody that's joined us okay now to get these other ones out of my way this one because it apparently didn't have enough. And I can easily pop this off after Halloween and use them for Christmas bottles. You never know. Heck far, I might even try and sell these. You never know. got this one to go. I'm not sure exactly how I want to do it, so. Do we have enough red? wonder how well that would cover. Let's check. Let's see. Yeah, that'll work. Uh-oh. Well, you have found the right channel. Read yourself of some negativity. Yeah, I've read about that, uh, KK. Did they ever find out what it was? <clears throat> yeah, the ulcer and forth. Great surgery. Wow.
so stay I can't eat a lot of spicy food it gives me heartburn and I don't like the heartburn at all it gives me indigestion something first <laughs> it sucks I eat spicy, it's mild. It has to be mild or I'm pushing it away. If it even burns my tongue, I say nope. This is the ugly duckling part of this. A lot of people go from the inside out, I go from the outside in. knock that off. Just leave it like that. See how big my key is. Y'all are talking amongst yourselves. That's good. I might, I used to make gyros. I used to work at a Greek restaurant. I know exactly how to make those. And the sauce that goes in it. I can't tell you. It would be a bad thing if I told. Oh, I gotta stand up for a second, guys. My legs are cramping up.
want to get on there. That's what I was making. And I'm going to wrap that around the box. Or not the box, but the, the thing once it's dry. And put soul jar. Hey, my exacto knife looks it works perfectly in that little spot that puppy chewed up of gills, or not gills, but Londis. All kinds of scrappy doos here. Not gal is a... Y'all are talking, still talking. A lot of people are getting sick and having complications too young to, if I think it has a lot to do with it. I drink a lot of bottled water. I don't drink a lot of tap water. That's the thing. But bottled water isn't always the best for you either. But that's why doctors always say drink distilled water or purified water or something like that. Michelle, you finish what you got to do, okay? This is still wet. I can't put anything on there until it dries. Fear. And let's try this. My plug is right up underneath my table. It's not as loud as my head drive. Maybe it'll dry faster. What now? What? Do I have any thumb down, ladies? I don't know. Get my mat bow up. Take it off so it don't mess it up. Put that down there. There you 
good karma. Aw, oh, thanks, KK. I am. Should be able to put that on here in a minute. Let that bottle cool off here for a minute. Oh. Give it her a minute. I'm still busy. Or still buying and hoarding Christmas to it, but did get seven ornaments done this week with two more for. Hey, Mom. Hmm. I can't wait till Christmas either. And to get back to working on our journal. I think we might uh, end that journal on that last page and get it put together. And I think I might do a sew-in instead of a glue-in. Because um, I don't remember where I put the, um, the outside for it, the binder. I might have to do a sew-in. Because those are a lot easier for me anyway. I can, but I need more time. Gail. Oh, Gail. Everybody needs to send, uh, send Gail a Christmas card. Yeah, send Miss Gale a Christmas card, Miss Bah Humbug. It is hot, and it's melting that. It's okay. Emily moment. Huh? Who, who said Emily moment? Mama, what, what happened? Yes, I had an Emily moment. It was every time I sit down, Emily always losing my stuff. <laughs> I do it every time I sit down, but I don't let y'all know I lose stuff. I just go and grab another one. Hot glue does not lock this ribbon. Look what it did. 
did not like it at all, but it's on there. It's together. It'll be the back. Nobody will see it. The minute it touches that hot glue, boy, it goes right up. Takes is a dot of that glue. It's on there. I might be a little loose, a little too far down, but you know, that I wanted. But I want to make a thing that says soul keeper. Sorry, I had technical difficulties. I had to mess with my phone. Ugh. Wow, a bunch of people left because of that. What happened? I had technical difficulties. I had to go and fix it. That's okay, we'll finish this up. So I got some things I gotta do today. Wow, everybody's coming back. I'm going to finish this one up and go get some things done because i got to go to the store and get me some kitty litter. The kitties has run out. This is what I was working on.
bet her battery craps out. What? No, my battery was fine. I just had a really bad connection, uh, Kiki. I sorry. Oh, don't glue me to it. Okay. All right, here's that so far. Then we're going to add the key to the front. Tire on. There you go, ladies. That was our last one. Our last bottle I could actually use because I had all the labels taken off. And I can't make no more. I was going to make one with bad eyes or like demon eyes. But I ran out of bottles. That's okay. Yeah, there we go. That was the last one. It's one of my nicer bottles. I mean, like I said, everything's in the back. Everything's kind of almost color printed with this one. So, yeah. I'm happy with this one. Make sure you guys give me a thumbs up if you all have liked these bottles that we have made today. We have made quite a few and given you all a little bit of an idea on what you guys can do for your home for Halloween. Uh, so, please let me know in the comments below if you liked the bottles and if... Uh, uh, you have even better ideas for our other viewers. So, ladies, I am going to go ahead and uh, hop off of here because I've got a few things that I've got to do to finish up. And um, and I hope that you guys uh, have enjoyed the show. And I hope you guys continue to come and uh, watch me. Um, if you're not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button. And uh, hit that bell button icon that gives you a notification that I will be going live or I'm going live and I am posting a videos. Um, I hope to see everybody again and I will make sure to let all of you know on my um, on my website. Now if you are not a member of my Creative Jewels by Emily please go and uh, check us out. We are a very friendly group and uh, we appreciate all artists and all kinds of art mediums. So don't be scared to post your uh, post your artwork because we are very uh, a very loving family of jewels and we support each other. Yes, remember to support me by sharing with your friends and, and in other groups. So um, I make all kinds of different art so this is not this this medium is not 
I'm getting tongue tied. This medium is not all that I can do. But uh, that's more in the future because if I do it all now, you all won't come back. So, ladies and gentlemen, if you do come and watch, please hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell. Yeah. Please share and comment. So, anyway, I will see you on my next broadcast, and I will make sure to post that in our group um, when I will be going live. So, ladies, you all have a great rest of your day, your evening, and your morning, whatever time it is for you. So, ladies, I love you all. I love all my jewels. So have a great day. God bless. Bye. Bye.